the Logitech Performance MX mouse. So here, let me unbox it. Let me just move this back a bit. All right, here we go. Look at that. Beautiful mouse, huh? It's a really great and big mouse. Even the packaging is nice. The Logitech MX Performance Mouse. I don't know if you can see this really clearly on the camera. Hopefully you can. This is a really expensive, but really, really, really good mouse. Um, it has, has a nice scroller. I can click this button here. Like, you can hear the sound from the scroller right now. I can click this button, and it can go into hyper-scrolling. Like, I, you, you probably can't see it, but it's actually, as I do this, the scroller keeps going. So if you're, work, if you're on a page that's really long, or if you're working on a long document, this can come in really handy. This has got a forward and back button so it can go back and forth when you're browsing the web or on certain applications you can use that. It's got a zoom button to zoom into photos, to zoom into um, stuff on the web, whatever application you're using again. It has another button right here which is exactly, uh, what's it called again? Expose, which is exactly expose. So. This mouse is special and it's expensive because it's wireless, of course. It's got something called dark field technology. What this is, is you can use this mouse on absolutely any surface. So if you got a glass table or you got almost any kind of table or surface that you're going to you're going to use a mouse on, you can get this and it will work perfectly on that surface. All right. So this small connector goes right in here. I turn this on and automatically we've got connection, guys. This is a brilliant mouse. I mean, Logitech is really good. It connects to the computer extremely fast. It takes like, what, half a second. Like, when I press this button, you can see, if you can see the screen here, it goes into expose. You might be thinking, why would I get a laptop and a mouse when they've got a really good trackpad? It's because when you're going to do heavy usage, it's really worth it to get a mouse. Like if I'm going to have, if I'm going to do something on Photoshop, especially if I'm an amateur user, I like to switch back and forth, looking at tutorials on Safari. Oh, that was pretty quick, actually, the Photoshop. All right, I like to. It's like drawing, it's like doing lots of stuff that you're going to do on the screen, which should be really tedious using the trackpad. I've tried it. If you use the trackpad continuously for like three hours, you're going to get really frustrated with this thing, no matter how good it is. That's why the mouse comes in really, really handy. I wouldn't recommend this for anyone that's going to do anything light because the trackpad is really good. But if you're a heavy user, you got to do lots of stuff on your computer and you're going to do it on a surface. Get a mouse. Better yet, if you have the money, Get the Logitech Performance MX mouse. It's worth every single drop of money. It's rechargeable. It's got a recharger cable. Let me just get it quick. It's somewhere here. La, la, la. There's. It came with a really nice bag that has the charger cable. You can see that it connects via USB to this. This, no wait, this is the charger cable, like, this will take probably a couple of hours to charge, but you're not gonna, you don't need to worry about that. The battery life of this thing is really good, you can use it for like a week, as long as you remember to turn it off when you're not using it. You can use this for like a week, heavily, until the battery completely drops. I've only charged this thing once and I've been using it for over a month. Did you hear me? Yep. And then this is the connector, connect this USB part to the computer and this part to the mouse in case it's running out as you're using the mouse. And let's say you're really far away from a screen, maybe it's a desktop screen or something and the reception is not really good with the computer. There's an extender, extender 
cable you connect this thing this small thing in here in here like you this will be actually be in here this will be connected to your computer and it's got this range and you can I think you understand what I mean. Then I like the pouch. It's good that since there's so many connect connecting things, they can all be together. The only one thing I don't like about this mouse is that it doesn't have its own carrying the case. So if you're gonna travel around and you want this one, there's another mouse called the the Logitech Anywhere mouse. It's a lot smaller, not good for my hands because my hands are big, and it fits this really nicely. But it's a lot smaller mouse. It has its own carrying pouch, but it has more or less the same functions as, as um, this mouse. I'm using this a lot more in just one place and it's completely worth it for me. I'm really satisfied with the performance of this mouse and yeah that's my review of the Logitech Performance MX mouse. You might not want to use this on a rocky surface because it will actually scratch the mouse and the mouse will become useless. Yeah no it was the, that's a really bad joke sorry. Mm -hmm.